All right, so you, how did you end up? Let's get to the store because that's something we can re- relate on. Because uh, you entered the. Uh, uh, I don't know, Mark. I went once with Michelle. Had a good time. Uh, it's not really a big part of my life. And the weird thing about the comedy store is everybody. You know, there's about nine or ten guys a night doing the same, roughly the same subject matter. Uh, let's move on to something else. Uh, as I said. Uh, I don't really have any connections to the comedy store. Your teeth are probably brushed, everything. Uh, Mark, I, I brush my teeth every day. Floss? Did you floss? I had a little popcorn last night, so yeah, I floss. Wait, what does that mean? Uh, what does that mean? That, that means I, I wrap string around my fingers and I put it between my teeth. Every day? Uh, almost every day. Well, that's not regular flossing. So, I mean, I just see already I found a weakness. Uh, Mark, did you even shower this morning? You know, I, I, didn't, I didn't shower, I just wet my hair. You've heard about Squarespace. It's the best way to build your own website. And now there's the latest version, Squarespace 7. You're going to record these now? It's a completely new design, and now it's even easier to make your own website. Really? You can integrate Google Apps into your site, so you can connect the site to I Gmail, you, I, use I Google Spreadsheets, hour. all that stuff. You can get. You know, I became a doorman at the Comedy Store in 1987. Uh, I don't know why you're bringing that up. Uh, I... There's no way I would remember you. There's something about the comedy store where you walk in and you just see those pictures, you see those names on the wall, and you're like, i got to be part of this. Uh, once again, I, I just want to request that you, you stop talking about the comedy store because uh, that is something that uh, I'm not interested in. I'm going to play some guitar. All right. I got the uh, Telecaster hooked up to a classic uh, Ibanez tube screamer. Okay. Uh, Earthquaker Grand Orbiter coming at you. Uh, that's a... Uh, Real nice, Mark. I really don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. You have any uh, other questions for me? Uh, no offense, Mark, but uh, when is this gonna end? You're uh, really jamming out. So you you got the grades to get into Harvard, obviously. I don't know why you're making it sound like a bad thing. What is what is this Harvard thing? It's a it's a school that. Uh, that uh, I went to, and that's all you need to know about that. Like, for some reason, I get hung up on um, on Harvard. Is there some sort of secret wisdom? Uh, Mark, there are some things uh, uh, you shouldn't know, and uh, I'm not going to tell you. What song is that with the guitar solo, man? Uh, let's uh, let's uh, calm down for a second. Uh, I- you were a reputed thief at the comedy store. Uh, what are you talking about? I, I, I never did comedy at the comedy store. But it's interesting to me that you know, like you're one of the only guys around, really, that has, you know, you know, gone through the whole arc of the comedy store. Mark, I don't appreciate being grilled about the comedy store when I had nothing to do with it. I'm done. So, so you need to to shut off the mic. This podcast is over. You're done. Uh, yeah, Mark. If you're if you're asking if I'm done. I'm done. We were having a good conversation. I don't want to talk about the comedy store. All right. Mark, uh, you're going to stay in this garage uh, and think about what you've done. Well, that didn't... Well, maybe it really went well. You're so self-obsessed, Mark. I don't know. I'm certainly not going to chase after him. The boys in blue are hitting the streets, and with good cop, bad cop action figures, you decide how to police the city. Grab a good cop, and you can protect the protesters. Wear a body camera, or de-escalate a situation. Or grab a bad cop, and you can use excessive force, lie under oath, or even racially profile. 